let's check the difference between this 2x Barlow from Celestron against this 5x Focal Extender from La Cirta. The competition will be using this small 6 inch Skywatcher Virtuoso GTI, it's a go to telescope to track the sky. But we need an object in the sky to point a telescope and it will be Jupiter Planet. I have to tell you that the results were impressive. You'll see in a moment. I also used my ZWO 294MC color camera with this adapter, which is a 2 inch to 1 and a quarter adapter, in order to fit this focuser. Don't worry because I will leave the links to all the materials I use in this video in the description below. Let me remember first that with a 2x Sparlow we will be working at f10. The telescope is an f5 and with a 5x focal extender we will be working at f25. The long focal lengths are always better to do astrophotography with the planets. And let me also remember you that if you use a Barlow with an eyepiece or a camera, if you move the eyepiece or the camera further away, you will increase the magnification. However, with a focal extender you can move it but it will not change the magnification. That happens because of the way the focal extenders and the Barlows are designed and I will address that in another video. Now let's go to Jupiter and watch the Dobsonian power. As usual, I'm using SharpCap software to get a live view of the planet. Both captures were made at different times. At the left you can see the 2x Barlow in action and at the right the 5x focal extender. You may be wondering why the 2x at the left is larger than the 5x at the right. <laughs> because I'm changing the region of interest which means that at the left I'm using a smaller area of the camera sensor and at the right at this moment a larger area. However, look what happened when I reduce the region of interest at the right. Now it's larger. If you don't know what I'm talking about, I recommend you to go to my live streams where I break down all these techniques. Also notice that although we tend to talk about magnification with a camera, in reality, we should talk about pixel scale, the relation between the pixel size of the camera and the focal length. Something you should know when choosing a camera to match your telescope. I have a good video explaining that. And after a few thousand frames captured, we do all the post-processing to get this. It's really amazing the performance of the 2x Barlow and the 5x focal extender but I'm specially impressed with the results of the 5x La Cirta Focal Extender. Remember that I just used a small 6 inch Dobsonian telescope. So if you are impressed as I was with the results of this 5x Focal Extender from La Cirta, I remember you that you can buy it from AstroArt Finland, our astronomical partner, with the links at the description. And next, click on this video over here to increase your level about Barlow's and Focal Extenders.